Welcome everybody, my name is Marcus Stone and in this video you will learn how you can easily use VLLO video editor for Android. So let's start. First, I'm going to click on a great video here and I'm going to find some video that I could use that I could edit. So for example this one here. You can also upload photo, GIF, but we will get to it. Let's go. Okay, first you are going to choose aspect ratio for your video that you want to use. I'm going to use for YouTube now. Okay, and right now we have it. First, this is really simple and I will show you how it works. You got a timeline and right now I'm just moving on the timeline. The next thing you can do is just press on your video and you can make it shorter, longer, really up to you. Let's make it shorter. Done. First, let's go with my bar here. What you can do is to add voice, sound effect and BGM that's music. When I'm going to click on BGM, I can use VLO library which is commercial OK or I can upload my own music to my video. When I'm going to put my own video like this one, see I have my video right here that I could use. I can fade it out, fade it in and also I could change volume. When it's done. I have audio here. I'm going to delete it for now. Then you can add sound effects, also transitions, appearance, up to you, really easy, and voice. When we have it, the next step is motion sticker. In motion sticker, you can insert stickers, labels, and templates. Also really up to you, delete. Then we have text. And this is also really simple. You can add text or you can add captions. When we add text and I click here on text, you can just move the text, make it bigger. Also really simple. Press OK. And then you can change the, what it's going to write there like snow. OK. You can change the font to something else. Like this one here. Let's make it bigger. Done. Then you can change the style and change like the words are always going to be red like this one but no only this one just the n is going to be red okay and now what else time range you can time it or animation you can fade out fade in and you can see the fade out now really cool and arrangement about like when you have a picture that you can put it behind the picture let's press done and as you can see we have text here right away the next thing is pip that you can add an overlay image over it so when i'm going to press image i know i got this jesus here i can make it like here and overlay it really simple so yeah now the last thing is filter. You can add some filters. So many of them, really simple. I don't know if like what else should I tell you about this. Okay, we have it. And now let's click on video and how we can edit it. Let's click on it. And first thing is that you can resize it if you would like, or better say crop it. Then you can change the background of your video. If you got the background there. So like this one, then you can change the audio or completely mute it, change the volume. Now you can change the speed of your video, also really, really easy. And just change the adjustment, brightness, contrast, filter. So this is how you can make it. And this is how you edit videos in Vevelo Video Editor. When you finish it, all you have to do is just click here, up, and resolution, high, frame rate, 30 FPS, and export. And now, opa, sorry, it's going to generate, yep, let's wait a little bit, 50 seconds, okay, and voila, here we have it. Okay, now we play it and here we go. 
So this is how we edit video in Velo Video Editor. Thank you very much everybody for watching. Have a great day and see ya. Goodbye.